Well, it's the middle of the night. My eyes are burning. I'm quite tired and I have a little bit of bed head going on. And yeah, I am feeling motivated to talk about a wild style lucid dreaming technique that I have been having a fair amount of success with over the last two and a half to three months. In that time period, I have had roughly two dozen experiences with this technique and I certainly see a lot of potential for it, potential to replicate and duplicate this technique over and over and over again. So here we go. Let's dive on in with the doorknob technique. Alrighty, so what we are going to be doing is throughout the night while drifting off to sleep in the middle of the night, and especially at the end of natural sleep cycles, we are going to visualize in our mind's eye with as much detail as we possibly can a door directly next to our bed. Really paint the picture and try to see what color is this door? What color is the door knob? Are there any symbols on this door? Add detail to the door and also visualize underneath your closed eyes, your arm extending out and grabbing the door knob. Repetition is a key in this practice over and over and over and over again. You want to visualize your arm extending out and grabbing the door knob. We are going to be pulling ourselves up and out into the dream and then walking through the door. So you are laying there visualizing this door with detail while visualizing your arm extending outwards underneath your closed eyes and grabbing that door knob. You may feel light, you may feel heavy, you may feel like you are sinking, you may feel like you are floating, you may feel tingly electrical energy surging throughout your body. You may feel a strong urge to move, roll over, or change position. You may feel a powerful itch. You may get an urge to clear your throat. You may hear phantom sounds as well as see imagery underneath your closed eyes. If you do see imagery, hopefully it is of the door that you have been visualizing or who knows a lot can happen within this borderline half awake half asleep state involving sleep paralysis like perhaps you will fall through the darkness behind your closed eyes into an experience of astonishing light from within well now, after a couple of minutes with the visualization exercise, you should begin to see the door underneath your closed eyes, as well as your arm extending out and grabbing that door knob. You also likely have been ignoring the powerful urge to move, the urge to clear your throat, as well as you're really trying to stay still the best you can. If you do not see, the door or the doorknob or your arm begin to extend out. Sharpen your intention within the mind. Visualize it like your intention is a ninja's blade. Seriously, just take a moment. Just pause that visualization of the door and see your intentions become sharper over and over and over again you are sharpening your intentions and then dive back into the visualization exercise if you still do not see anything then raise your confidence be confident that you will see this door let go of any doubt will it to happen believe that you will see this door know that you are going to see it anticipate seeing the door underneath your closed eyes and your arm extending out until it happens until you really see it 
and you can feel that door knob in the palm of your hand. Wow, I am super tired now and am looking forward to heading back to bed. So I'm going to bring this video to a close. I hope that you have enjoyed it. If so, please consider taking just one moment to tickle the algorithm a little bit. Tickle, 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 tickle with a like, comment, subscribe, and maybe even a share. For more content from me, consider checking out my flow page at flowpage.com slash Jeffrey Randall. For now, peace out and best of luck with the doorknob technique.